Hey, Detective Sipowitz. You know it's all on the radio how arrests were made on all those murders. Did you come in to congratulate us, Mr. Futrell? I guess while somebody was doing some real detective work, you stayed busy harassing me and my friends. Yeah, well, I'm sorry you took it that way. I want to hear you say you harass me. I want to hear you say that me and my friends are not suspects, which Detective Andrew Sipowitz might find it hard to believe since he thinks we're all a bunch of low-life niggas. All right, Lewis, you made your little speech. You're done now. No, I'm done when I say I'm done. I'm telling you, you're done. I want to hear about George Washington Carver again, you ignorant, cracker bigot. S excuse me, what's your business here? This is Mr. Lewis Futrell, Lieutenant. He was questioned on that Sloan matter. He was cleared. Then your business here is finished. You know, I'd love to take it with you one-on-one -on -one sometime, man. You don't have your gun and your fire hose and your badge. Let me give you my card, huh? Sipwitz, thank you for your cooperation, Mr. Futrell. You can leave now. They letting you work in the big house now, boy? What door are you coming? You should leave now. You busy tonight? I got no big plans.